one players and YouTubers alike. I am James Giant Staff. You already know my partner there, the Lady Cleo. And my kitty, Sir Boots. And my co-host, Lindsay Flame. Hello there. Welcome to another Stick of Truth. Lady Cleo, what's the staff got on tap for us today? The ever-loved topic by me, Japanese food. Japanese food, dun dun dun. We are now about to talk about something Lady Cleo enjoys greatly. For once, the giant staff is actually going to let his co-host and his partner speak first. So, Japanese, when you think of it, you immediately think sushi. There are many types of sushi, but what is your favorite, Lady Cleo? I love... Ah, I actually don't know the name of it. But for this, I will say, um, Irike. I have not tried that one. Um, as for me, I like the California roll, the tiger roll, the dynamite roll. Oh, there's so many rolls. I just, oh, I love sushi. What about you, Mr. Giant Staff? The Giant Staff loves takiyaki. Fried octopus balls. Those are his favorite. Fried okay, Can we think about that one for a bit? Fried octopus balls. You don't want to think about that for much. Just, it is just kind of a weird thing. Just let it oh. sink in for a bit. <laughs> yep. So, yeah, that's been about, uh... 25 seconds of jokes. <laughs> <laughs> yep. So, yes. have you guys tried any weird foods? Oh, yes. So, Lady Cleo has. So, has the job staff. Do tell. Go for it, Lady Cleo. It is called squid rolls, it is a bread roll which contains the eggs or unborn children of squids. You're eating In a black children? Pace. <laughs> You're oh, eating poor. children! Oh, of course, it is very common with my people. I'm suddenly scared of your lady Cleo. <laughs> oh, yes. Yeah, you should be. If you've seen Pirates of the Caribbean, uh, yeah, on Stranger Tides, then you know mermaids are scared. This is why you don't mess with my people, Giant Staff. Yes, two things. One, the Giant Staff will never piss off Lady Cleo. <laughs> two, the Giant Staff will never ask Lady Cleo to babysit. <laughs> oh, why? You know I'm a good babysitter, if the child doesn't annoy me. Never asking the Lady Cleo to babysit. Huh. So me. I looked after my kitty well. So, what about your weird food experience, Sir Giant Staff? The Giant Staff is eating live octopus. Like movie octopus? Yep. Trust me, it's something that once you experience once, you're probably never going to do again. They do actually try to crawl back out. What?! And you're not supposed to bite them. Nope. Gotta swallow it. You have to I swallow it whole. I've eaten octopus before, but not alive. Yeah, you gotta get them to swallow, otherwise they try to crawl back up. I have another oh. weird tail. Get the pun? Do you want to hear my tail, Giant So? Yes, regale us. It was the one time I tried living squid. Oh, this should get fun. 
it was kind of bad. I had not known what I ordered until it was set in front of me because it was a Japanese restaurant. Everything was in a foreign language to me. Uh, they brought me my plate, and I had a bit of a freak out. Um, they told me to eat it because it wasn't bad. It smelled good. It looked different. Okay, I went to stupidly cut it and got squirted in the face. Uh, I would hit you with the sick of divination. Oh, okay. <laughs> okay, the waiter re brought my food after I asked, and he Sorry. helped me clean my face. Oh, God. That's what he said. That's- <laughs> <laughs> okay, so they told me to try it. It was a small squid, it was delicious. It tried to crawl up my throat. Twice. Would you be choking? No. That's what she said to you, I'm sorry. <laughs> <laughs> I oh. curse you. And. I curse you. Well, squids have no bones. The gods are they amused. Can't this, uh, the, throat. the gods um, are very amused. Lady Cleo curses the gods as well. See? Let them be a lesson to you, folks. Don't make fun of a mermaid. They'll curse you. Indeed. I have used? handed out three curses so far. We are still Anymore? amused. <laughs> <laughs> yes, the giant staff has also tried eel. I've tried eel. And it stung that? me. Oh. It stung you? It stung me. Oh my god. Well, yeah, eel is I've also tried jellyfish. These are foods that I didn't even know you could actually eat. Yeah, I've had actually had jellyfish. Put it on some toast with some peanut butter, it's great. So good. <laughs> but yes, the giant staff tried eel. Um, he let it get cold, and it started moving on its plate again. Oh my god. I would legit throw my table over if I saw that happen. <laughs> At least. No, no. At least you not tried by flounder. Flounder? Yeah, yeah no. <laughs> Well, no, it wriggles on your plate. It's so cute. It just like flap, 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 flap. Yeah, but like the giant staff was told, don't let it get cold. It'll start moving again. And you let it get cold. Obviously, <laughs> the giant staff had to see for himself if the legends were true, and then <laughs> it will literally come back to life and flip around on the plate. Okay, live flounder's a lot creepier than live cold eel. Because it will literally flap the little disc of skin around it. It's so cute. How is that cute exactly? Because it looks like it's fly- trying to fly off your plate. It's so That's cute. Yes. The giant staff also, at some point, is going to take a trip to Japan to try the black burger. It is a burger. Oh, oh yes, I want to try that too. Yes, it is a burger that is colored with squid ink. It has a black bun, black cheese, and it's a teriyaki burger. Sadly, the giant staff is afraid of planes. Yes, the giant staff has acrophobia and fear of planes, but he will get over it to go to Japan, for that is the place of his soul. You know you're going to have to put me in a tank, right? Or just a suitcase. A suitcase works. You are cursed double over now, Missy. <laughs> That's it. Gods, I hear you up there, gods. <laughs> we are yes, amused. Yes, the gods. We are we very are amused. Know that I have first heard twice. And for all the fans out there, leave the most interesting food you have ever ate in the comment section below. Maybe leave a story behind it too. Or your favorite sushi roll. Oh, see, leave suggestions. Get the sushi. No, That's I want suggestions person. because I would love to. The fish to try does not sushi. want to hear about sushi. <laughs> I love sushi. Yeah, and that's why she moved away from me. Because it discriminates against fish. But you eat fish. Of 
Of course I eat fish, but they don't she discriminate is against my pets. Okay, um... Yeah, conflict of interest, Lady Cleo. <laughs> of course I have a conflict of interest. I won't eat a lionfish or a pufferfish. I'm not stupid. But you eat something that will crawl up your throat. Yes! That's what she said. <laughs> I'm gonna crawl up your throat if you don't get caught. <laughs> nice one, Lindsay. High five, gods! High five. The Lady Cleo will crawl up your throat and get you if you're stop it. <laughs> He will gut you with the stick of divination. Okay, so yes, it went from food to food violence. Food fight! <laughs> the ultimate food fight. Oh, yes. What, who's and fighting for the is going to go enjoy a rice ball, for it is one of his favorite Japanese foods. So, again, in the comment section, leave your most interesting food choices when it comes to Japanese food. We like Doritos. Drop us a story. Send us a comment! We may talk about it in another stick of truth. For this has been... Another stick of truth. <laughs> <laughs>